Yo, what is up everybody? It's Sweeper back with another banger video. Today we are going over the ban situation. And I know some of you guys want to hear my opinion on it, so let's go. Let's run into this stuff. We're going to play some ladder games in the background. Um, I'm going to try not to talk about them, but I may just, you know, be quiet and lock in. But basically, Aragon, Nate, and Riley all got banned on their alt accounts for uh, dupe glitching. Okay, this is just the most broken card in the game. You guys know why? You guys know why? So yeah, we're going to stop this. And basically what ended up happening was... I'm just gonna say right now they exploited a bug in Clash Royale which let them get better rewards because the fucking lucky drops are kind of shit and they just you know dupe glitched it which I don't think is horrible you know what I mean so many players did it but only what 600 players got 31 day bans especially creators which doesn't make any sense so that's basically the situation that happened and people were pissed about it people were like okay this is like such unfair bans because how are you just gonna ban these players for a glitch when you don't you don't enforce your rules right and that's kind of what the big drama is about. They weren't enforcing the rules, and everyone's just, you know, super pissed about it. Which, I don't blame them. Shit, I'd be pissed too. So basically, we're going to do this. You can take some damage here, but it's not going to be the end of the world. I think that should, you know, activate king. Who am I to judge? Does he have delivery? What's with everyone running this delivery poison deck, man? Oh my god, it's annoying. Lava keeps getting stronger, eh? Pump up here. We're down a bit of elixir, but it's not the end of the world. Mm. <laughs> like, dude, what? Guy, like, they always—they're always gonna go evil bomber at the bridge. They're very bad players, but it is what it is. Just gonna go in with this. No delivery, or anything like that. Go poison. Let's make it another pump down. It's really this is really poorly played by him. You have to be king, but like you're down so much elixir. Can I punish him for it? I don't think so. He's got evil Tesla. Let's find out. We can. <laughs> like what can I do, eh? Ah! You actually do poison that late. That's crazy. We're gonna go giant here. Now he's in the back. Yeah, it's game. I don't know. I can't fucking focus on this meta. This game sucks. This game truly does suck so much. And people have been saying this is like the worst the game's ever been in. And I, I could agree with that. You know what I mean? The game's actually in like a really bad state. For just everything wise. You know what I mean? Not just the... Uh, what is it called? That's yeah, stupid. Wow. Well played, buddy. This is just annoying. He was down so much luck, so he's defending because of natives and everything like that. Like, cool. I don't get it. Team blows. Team blows. I want to put laning in this deck, to be honest. Like, arrows, you don't need arrows. Let me just put laning in so I can actually do fucking beat down pushes, bro. So annoying. So annoying. Check this out. We're gonna move this, put landing in. That's gonna work. Ah, oh, I hate this game right now. It's it's not fun because it's literally been drill, 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 lava, lava, golem, golem, golem. 
Like, it's just, it's, and it's Evil Bomber everywhere, man. Like, there is not a deck without Evil Bomber. Like, this card needs to be emergency nerfed. That's the bigger problem, these fucking bans. Jesus. But yeah, so basically, then they made their uh, Reddit post on it, pretty much, saying we had 750 temp bans and 61 permanent bans, and they said the permanent bans were an error. It's not an error. They they got too much backlash. They decided to fucking stop the permanent bans. Fairs only matters don't hurt your pockets, real. And I, I know so many players who did it, you know what I mean? Like, it is just stupid that only, what, 750 players got away with it? It doesn't make any sense, to be honest. Like, they are they're not they're not a great company, to be honest. <laughs> they're really not a great company. But uh, it is what it is. That's Supercell for you. Basically, when it hurts their pockets more than anything else, that's... And then when they get community backlash, that's when they actually start doing changes. Not, like, you know, normal changes like normal be human beings. So reverse RG here. I'm going to get a good lightning here because people don't expect the lightning. And this should just be game if he goes Fisherman. Yeah, should just be game. I got pump as well. You're down so much. GG. See, I'm so fucking high IQ with these deck changes. Putting in landing for arrows. Like, what does arrows even kill? It doesn't even kill bomber at the bridge, bro. Fucking useless card. Nerf evil bomber, though. So I'm just going to wait till we get the elixir. Then I'm going to go uh, Night Witch on top of his thing. Because I think it's a high DPS right now. Because the bat's spawning. When he goes RG at the bridge, his only thing to do is punish right now. And that should just be game for us. You know? That's crazy. That's a crazy play. I'm not going to lie. Fish sure I'll tackle them, right? Oh no, what is this play, buddy? You should have went at the bridge there. Gun fisherman on defense. You can't just let that go. Oh well. More for me, right? <laughs> nah, it's crazy. This might just be the biggest stomp I've ever had in Clash Royale. It's all because, like, he doesn't know my deck, so he did the most predictable plays on defense. We all know Super Scam, and they're also, like, testing the waters of another ladder season. With, like, with, like, Mega Draft again and Sudden Death. I'm like, bro, stop, man. Stop. Like, it's insane how bad these community managers are for, like, yeah, system error. Who believes this? Yeah, it's not a system error. And they only found 180. There was way more than 800 exploited. I'll, I'll be real. I know every and they and they nitpicked it too because like, hey, I I don't mean the call out creators, but Juicy J did it on the stream. You know what I mean? These other players have done it on their lives and shit like that, and they got no repercussions. But they ban like you know Nate, who I'm facing right now. Nate, uh, hello, Nate, Riley, and Aragon. For what seems like no reason. So that that's just my two cents on it. I think it's I think it's dumb. I think it's ridiculous. I think they can, I think the community's super out of touch, man. Like, it doesn't make any sense why they do it. And I just wish there was more more communication with, you know, what we got. <laughs> Cause we I'll be real with you guys, we could barely get any communication. Like it is it is depressing the amount of communication we get from Clash Rail. Like it's actually sad. So, I'm gonna go landing here. Uh-huh. <laughs> I should I should not have done that. I should have just pumped up and got my advantage. That was a mistake by me. Really bad, uh, really bad play right there. 
Yeah, ex excuse that play. I'm going too aggressive in single because I'm like, it's a good matchup to me, so I go more aggressive. But I really just gotta fucking keep my dick in my pants right now because we gotta play slower here. But yeah, I, I feel bad for the people who got their accounts banned and got really like nitpicked right now. Um, it's not fair to them. It's not fair to anybody really. So, Clash Royale, if you're seeing this, yeah, come on, boys, be fucking better than this. Like, you, you guys are not a small indie game. <laughs> you know what I mean? You guys do not need to do all this shit, right? It doesn't make any sense. All right, he poisons here. He, 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 the problem with Nate is he always goes his Tesla's way too high. Shout out Nate. If you guys aren't subbed him, subbed him. He's a great player. But yeah, that's just kind of my my two takes on the band situation. I think it's it's ridiculous what they're doing. And I just wish there was communication. You know what I mean? That's a big thing. That's why we took for granted what Drew, Seth, and like Rick and all these people have done. It's just like they actually communicated with us about like why they were doing the things they did. But now it's just like once again, it feels like talking to a brick wall. You know what I mean? And there's like there's no there's no hey why and they're like <laughs> like what i don't know it's crazy that the game just doesn't listen to anybody man they just listen to themselves um there you go yeah that's kind of just my two takes on it boys what do you guys think in the uh, comment section below uh and yeah see you guys next banger video i'll probably be streaming tonight and yeah i'll see you guys there